Beyond the stratosphere, at about 50 kilometers, lies the third layer, the mesosphere. It's this layer that protects us from meteors. When we see a shooting star, it's actually a meteor burning up high in the atmosphere. The mesosphere is also home to a strange phenomena called noctilucent clouds. They're thin, wispy clouds that can only be seen at sunset when they're illuminated from beneath by the low sun. Finally, beginning at 85 kilometers, there's the fourth layer, the thermosphere. The atmosphere is so thin here that beyond 100 kilometers is declared to be the beginnings of space. It's in this layer that the space shuttle orbits the Earth. It's also out here that the sun's lethal solar wind is intercepted by Earth's magnetic field and diverted towards the poles creating the aurora. But there's another way of looking at the atmosphere. If you could unwrap the atmosphere from the surface of the Earth and put it all into a ball, this is what it would look like. In fact, the volume of the atmosphere is just 5% of the Earth. 